Switching gears now, a new Grand Valley State survey analyzes the regional economy and predicts what West Michigan could see this year. 13 on your side, Shana Grove is in the Information Center with its findings. Hey, Shana. Good morning, Camity. So this survey predicts the West Michigan economy will continue to slow in 2020. It was released just an hour ago and says West Michigan should see flat employment numbers and weaker sales growth. GVSU economics professor Paul Isley spearheaded the report. He says other outside factors, including the presidential election, are also worrying local business leaders. Businesses don't know where we're going to end up. So what's happening right now is we're seeing businesses pull back on the amount of uh, investment they're doing until they can figure out what the playing field is going to be politically. While there are those concerning signs, Isley says there are still plenty of positives to focus on when it comes to the West Michigan economy. The best thing we have going is people are employed, uh, their wages are going up, and we have a pool of young workers uh, that is larger as a percentage of our population than in most places in the United States. Isley's research focused largely on Kent, Muskegon, Ottawa, and Allegan counties. Remember to check out the Trade Up West Michigan section of the 13 on your side website. It's dedicated to showing the skilled trades and manufacturing opportunities available throughout our area. You can find it in the feature section of 13onyourside.com. Camby.